It is now later. We open the fence, and we do this thing. And then you can see the light on the left hand side next to the health bar there. But surprisingly, if you are directly under the light, it only goes about halfway up. I think as a pale man wandering around in the dark streets under a street light, that might show up a bit more. Back is turned, we'll just up the steps. And how the hell did you get here? Quiet, they're inside here. It seems that shovelhead outside just got separated from his pack. He's wounded too. Go take care of him. Don't worry, he's probably greener than you. How can you see his shade from here? He's on the other side of the wall, you fucking idiot. The Sabbat, you see, they don't have the most rigorous training. In fact, that poor sod is lucky if he knows he's a vampire. Bio green paint is still fairly fresh. Ah, he's probably just turned and beaten over the head. They like to do that, make shock troops, cannon fodder, put him out of his misery. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. He is a vampire, so be ready. Vampire or no, he meets his maker. Go get him. Or rather, his unmaker. And I am getting. It's me, I'm his unmaker. Ah. And now you are fucking hysterically. And I beat the shit out of him some more. And now I have a tire iron. Ho, ho, ho. That's that. Sounds like you got another pack moving in, though. The Saban are going all out. Better head underground, avoid straight bullets. Despite the fact they don't really bother me. This plan is fine to me. Alright, head down into the basement through the grate in there. Keep that tire iron handy. I'll be there in a minute. I will not wait for you, Jack. That's a strange place for a toilet. Right here in the middle of a... Yeah. Stop. Huh? Combat is not the only solution for tricky situations. And this is when I get to one of my favorite parts of Dementation. You got the blue, which is Persuasion. You got the, gr the pink, which is Seduction. You got the green, which is Intimidation. But for me, I get the red. Dementation. Where I focus just a little bit of madness into their brain and break them. You! Just stay back. Keep your distance. Now who the hell are you? You involved in all this? Cause I'm gonna radio this in and SWAT will be all over this place. Flee. Flee from fair. Show. <laughs> Show me the path. Yeah, okay. Alright. This way. This will lead us up to the warehouse. We can maybe sneak out that way. He doesn't sound particularly scared. Follow me not, if you want to live. Also, I'm thirsty. Never pass up free blood. Rule number one of vampires. And while he's doing that, we'll just go ahead and sneak around the corner. Huh? Uh, we're gonna break a neck. Full tree. Trust the old tire iron here. Snap! Not sure what's going on. Sounds like the Sabbat's getting scattered. I'm gonna keep an ear to the ground. Be careful going forward here. Could be a whole mess of them hold up. Why don't you go first then?
Yeah, this is the part where we got a blood buff in order to get past the lock. Unless you, uh... I think there's maybe one or two clans that start off with enough lock picking to just get past it regardless. Oh, dip. Um... Hmm. I'm gonna have to look at my key bindings real quick because I have auto repeat and that will drain my blood real quick if I don't turn off blood buff. And I'll discipline X. Thank you. Jack, is that you just on the other side of the goddamn wall? Ah, there he is. I totally didn't know he was there. And then I sneak up, and then... Ah, that was a mess. Sick of your nonsense. Old trusty tire iron has your ways. Jack. I think Fine, they're clear out. There's no need to go stirring up the hornet's nest till we know the score, though. Head through here. And come to an elevator around the way. To the next encounter at the elevator. Meet you there. Don't Which is a very you. straight and linear path, by the way, and he still gets there before me. Go to hell, Jack. You and your mysterious ways. Affuscate. The power of empiric invisibility. Not the best power for me right now, because I only got level 1. Which is visible as long as I am perfectly still. When I move, I'll become visible, but I'll be surrounded by, like, a cloudy mist. And then we snap the neck. And then we snap the neck. Oh, finally, the good one. Causing visions and madness in others. I love it. It's just fun. I can only imagine the bullshit I would do with this ability in the pen and paper game. My favorite D&D &D character was a illusion necromancer. Ah, oh, he was fun. Running around with a bunch of undead minions and making them look human all at the same time. Oh, yeah, yeah, they're with me. They're all just uh, mute. Yeah, that's it. Let me see, mass hallucination. Old trusty tire iron, let's do it. Ah. Okay. This is not going according to plan. Zero damage. Zero. I am better off with my hands. I read that. You can pick up an object and throw it. You will see this icon. Though an object makes noise, it can be used to distract your enemies. Especially when the vampire with the Sabbat vampire up ahead is freaking stupid. Watch. What was that? Well, I guess I'll just walk over here. And... Well, well, what was it? Oh my god! No, 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 no. Snap! Did I have to do that? No. Did I want to? Yes. <laughs> Fucking humans. Gangbangers protecting their turf. Oh man, 
I'm here thinking it's Sabat moving up in here. It's the fucking locals about to take one for the hood. Ah, see? By killing that vampire, I saved a gangster. That's a win in my book. Do we lick these locals? I mean... Ladies? Yeah, they probably seen too much. Here, take this 38. Fucking pea shooter, but a few shots and it'll take down a human. These kinds of peas are undoubtedly deadly. Well, I'm gonna want it back, so don't go die and lose it. But we're gonna steal it. Guns much? They're noisy. They're clumsy. Practically useless against vampires, but still, a kindred's gotta keep up with the times. And in modern day Los Angeles, that means coming strapped. Firearms sound foolish and feeble. Well, you know, some are more lethal Should've than others, of course. Watch out for those shotguns, Alex. Those things can smart, I tell you. I'll make sure to bypass any boomsticks. Head up and clear out what's left of them. Can't have them running their mouths about any of this. I'm gonna make sure there's no stragglers around outside. I will do this deed. Perception of firearms. Again, Auspex is going to make the firearm skill exceptionally useful for me. It's just good. And then we stick. We take the bullets. We take all of them. Don't venture too far, Whiskers. I'll be one to you later. Okay, I missed. There we go. Come here, Whiskers. Where'd your buddy go? Ah, you thought you could escape me, Whiskers number two? Never pass a free blood. Never. That door is never open. Though, I always wonder what's on the other side of it. You are just not being helpful, are you? Veil of Madness. He'll be too busy laughing at his own shadow for the next few seconds. Hey, where you going, man? Leaving me free to do this. Stop, man. Hey, stop! Hey, yeah. Ow! I mean, he's already dead. Yeah. Your turn. Never passed a free plot. <laughs> when it comes to human opponents, this is the best and easiest way to take care of them. And usually the most profitable. Except when they're already dead. Now, Jack, you didn't see this, but this is how I steal your weapon. That's it, kiddo. Just like that, and it's all over. Everyone slinks back to their corners of the city for the night. Sure that this blood drama continues. Until the next night, when the Camarilla finds some way to strike back, parry, dodge, spin, and all that, and so on, and so on, and so on. These are likely battles of this ancient game. Well, to be honest, it came at a, well, an interesting time, let's say. The Camarilla, the Sabat. Well, in LA, these are the new kids on the block. There's already plenty of kindred had stakes down in California long before them. Now, we got every ancient kindred rivalry playing out all over the city. A lot of tension out there. A lot of fear. A lot of jittery, high-strung predators clinging to their little pieces of eternity. Hell is my eternal madness. Can't even stay on top of it. Oh, boy. Oh, I think they're looking for you outside. Guess you got a cab to catch. Was hoping to fill you in on a little bit more, but... Ah, hell, you'll figure it all out. If you make it back, stop in at the last round. It's his bar down there. You didn't see that. I'll fill you in on the politics. <laughs> now that's the stuff that'll You didn't kill. see this either. <laughs> Good luck. I'd be pissed if this wasn't so cute. <laughs> oh, Jack, you're hilarious. Anyways. Oh, man. I haven't played this game ever since. 
quite some time. Like, I don't even think they had the official patch out last time I played this game. It was glitchy, it was buggy, and this glass certainly didn't look that good. And it's still having fucking hurricane season out there. Look at them electrical wires go. Hey, the password for your computer is Sunrise. Keep the cash in the drawer, it's yours. I dropped you an email with my address. Come on after you. Come on over after you get settled. Mercurio. Thanks, Mercurio. At your convenience, please come and visit me in my home downtown. I leave you this to guide you. Dark blood, our curse, our light, this verse. Such power I sense in one so young. Come find me where burns the mystical sun. M. Strauss, Tremere Regent. Hey, hey. So broke, you can't even pay attention. Well, I can now. Set for a night on the town. A hundred bucks. Not really the same impact anymore. A hundred bucks. But. Let me see. We got drugs. Yay, drugs. And a cheap watch. I don't think I see anything else. And a toilet that was certainly not go used. Uh, one toothbrush for each of my minds. I think they a few of them share. Radio. Hello, LA. You're up way past your bedtime, aren't you? Hope you've yes, slept something comfortable. If you're new to town or just new to this, do game, do this. Okay, it's a fire hazard. The death of night. The only girl who will spend the night. I certainly didn't the order these. The morning, guaranteed. Well, looks like the boards are lighting up. Aren't I the popular one? Let's see. And the safe of this particular place. Caller, you've got the first you can drop things in the now. fridge and it'll stay there. So, who do I have the but I, I want to take this. If I get Vigo. close to the cap, like so, if I start holding like eight Vigo, or nine, I'll consider dropping a few back in the fridge. No, you don't have to keep them refrigerated though. Uh -huh. It's just in there for own, RP yeah. reasons, I guess. I used to do a little yachting myself. What brand Boring. Glendale in Long Beach. In both cases, the bodies of the victims were described as ripped, torn, bloody entrails smeared upon the walls, splatter on broken windows, ah, feet much more in weird places, murder, feet murder, in weird places. <laughs> a massive gelatinous creature that <laughs> washed on the mean? beaches of Providence, Rhode Island, has scientists scratching their heads. Hey, good for them. Is tonight a rerun? We're going to email this shit. I'm gonna hack my own goddamn computer. And fail horribly. Not a single one of my minds could crack that. Fine, sunrise. A reminder. From the Jester Prince himself. Mercurio will contact you when you arrive in Santa Monica. Waste no time in meeting with him. SL. You can't just sign your name, LaCroix. It's gotta be SL, you pompous bastard. Dang, it's big. Penis enlargement. Watch the girls come running. Probably away, because, I mean, how big do you need to get it, honestly? 1-800-555-STICK. Kilpatrick's Crime Butter. Dirt Cheap Internet VTM. Ah, uh, the blue light special, I see. Looking for that lazy ass ex ex husband who's laid on his alimony payments. How about that jerk who knocked you up? Well, in current America, that's no longer a problem. You're having that baby regardless. Fucking psychos. Like, America made more sense when I first played this game than it does now. It just, it just did. Back then, I remember people being pissed at just George Bush. That was enough. We've gotten way worse than that. I would rather just be a vampire. I mean, I wanted to be a vampire then, but it's almost certainly a better life choice now. <laughs> Freaking chicken. 
That's some good fucking chicken. Amazing crime butter. You can find almost anyone with a record. And these days, that's just about everyone. So come on down to Arthur Kilpatrick's Bail Bonds. If you've got the deadbeat, we've got the technology to find them. What is this? It's friggin' chicken. This is cat, right? Are you feeding me cat? Holy. That's gotta be like the best commercial in the background. Nine out of ten people preferred friggin' chicken over the competition. Welcome from Mercurio. Hey, welcome to town. Come on over to my place when you get situated. We'll be talking about what you'll be needing to do to get the job done. I'm going to pick up some explosives right now, some astrolite. I should be back by the time you come over. My 24 Main Street, number 4. Walk right to the end of the alley, my building, the next one on the right, dash M. You are also a pompous bastard. Sign your Sam, your damn name. The opening from a friend. The game begins upon his mood. You never really find out who that is explicitly, but you figure it out just just by the the way he talks, the way he converses with you later, at the very end of the game. That's the end of my emails. I'll be quitting, and we'll pick this up later. Good night, vampire.